my paintings are very physical. They've got, um, instead of having a 64th of an inch of relief or 100, you know, 28th or whatever, they're like a half an inch deep. Some of them, a few of them deeper, which is a you know, comparatively a lot of paint and a lot of uh, physicality. It started actually with representational uh, imagery. There's a weed that grows in, well, actually a whole big swath of the USA, wild cucumber. And there's a lot of different varieties of it. Over winter, they wither away. And in the spring, there's this gorgeous pod that's uh, parchment colored and it's very delicate. And the front end of the thing is opened up because it's a seed pod. And I was kind of intrigued and I put, I just grabbed a whole bunch of the vein vine and put it away for, I don't know, a couple of years as emergency subject matter. And one day I pulled it out, started painting, did uh, representational work and sort of, sort of representational work. I realized that they were sort of a license to experiment with more and more textural stuff. And it has gotten to the point now where the paintings are like half an inch thick or thicker with these big mounds of paint still dealing with that same subject but mixing the the you know the painting aspects with a very uh, pronounced sculptural aspect so. the reason why i joined dance was because i wanted to do something different when i first started i felt nervous because i before i didn't really dance in front of people so it's like a big step for me i just love being here with my friends and having new friends and other grades, which is good. Yeah, I thought it was gonna be um, pretty tough and stuff, but uh, once you um, start doing it a lot, it tends to get better and easier and it's fun. I really like this group because I love to dance. You can make new friends and be able to not be scared to show who you are. We've been doing this for three years now. We started it probably because we had an interest in dance and we wanted to definitely want to bring the kids into this because they needed a place to go to that was safe for them. And being that we have so much diversity coming in, this is like a great opportunity to start this in New Hampshire. We practice twice a week and well, three times a week now because our performance is on Friday. They're all fun. There's five songs. They're all pretty long. It's kind of hard to memorize the moves. So like the older dances, we have to do them like every day to refresh our memory. And there's going to be a lot of costumes, there's going to be a lot of just obviously changing of the costumes and just, I mean, they're going to have a good time. I to try putting out a book of poetry that I've been writing for about 40 years. I started when I was uh, in Vietnam as a stress release. And so I had a quite a, a backlog of poetry that I had written to relate to my real life experiences and um, I thought I'll put out a book and, and see what happens. And I decided to use color photography because it struck me that we're in a color world now and a lot of the poetry was still in a black and white world. Uh, really there hadn't been many innovations since the 1900s, early 1900s or the 1800s as far as the way the books were presented.